Batista from Lino's with us. Are we back? Good afternoon, Joe. Uh, what do I, what I'm, I'm worn out already. Yeah. <laughs> I got the pasta here. I've been food processing. We're actually cooking today. Yeah, we are. Um, <clears throat> you know, I, I was like, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Don't break up the pasta. Okay, please. Don't. So, <clears throat> what am I going to do? What am I going to do? I called Brenda last night and I said, you know, I've got nothing. And she says, well, try to do something relevant. <clears throat> and, um, and I'm like, relevant? Uh, it's springtime. I don't know, you know, what, what is, is what is, right, okay, yeah. so I was actually um, thinking about that the other day because I was driving to work and I saw some asparagus on the side of the road growing, growing wild, and I thought, I thought I should go back and pick it. First, when oh, I started first, talking about, oh, oh, oh. asparagus grows, grows wild on the sides of roads? Come on. <laughs> <laughs> you can tell he's not Italian. There's a lot of there's a lot of Italian people that that go enjoy that. They, yeah, they go okay. pick an asparagus. They do go they? on the, yeah on the sides of the roads, okay. and this is the time of year to do it. Okay, I didn't know. We also pick dandelions when they first come up, and we do it with chicken soup or with pasta. And huh? it's anyway. salted from the winter season. Exactly. Yeah, I don't know about that. <laughs> anyway, so what I did was I took about two pounds of asparagus, not that I picked on the side of the road. Okay. And I um. I does everybody know how to how to clean and cut asparagus? Just you, back up and let you do it. You yeah, don't, you well, don't cut it. You snap it, right? You snap, you snap it, it yeah. right? You snap it. And it it it, it uh, snaps right at the tender point, and then you got you got the good asparagus. But what I did was, I snapped it one more time, and I used all these stems. I put it in a frying pan, and I and I um, I cooked it with on, about one onion, a third of a cup of olive oil. Um, salt and pepper, I put a little bit of garlic in there which is not on the recipe and I cooked it down and then once it was done mm. I took it and I made a puree out of it. Okay. Well, okay. Yes. And we're gonna take that and we're gonna put and then I took the tips, I put a little bit of water in the pan that I already had going and I and I cooked that just till it was done. Taste that. Which is the better part? Which is the tastier part? Oh, uh, the, the, that part. The, the tips? Yep, yep, mm. yep. Mm. So, yeah. then I, I used a pasta that is going to suck up all that puree. It's Campanelli pasta. And you uh, can. Does you that can, grow by the side of the road too? No, no, no it's, okay. it's uh, actually a, a Brillo. It's an Italian uh, pr uh, product. But anyway, this, uh, this is, that name means either little flower or bell, okay? Okay. So, we, I thought that, excuse me, yeah, these guys are, where'd it go? I'm uncoordinated <laughs> today. So, what I did was, I put my pasta in, right. and that's about ready to come. Okay. I wish I was taller. The absorbing pasta. The absorbing pasta, yeah. Not found on the side of the road. Right. So, we're, we're gonna, gonna pull this dip. out. Little let it bells. Drain. Little bells. Yeah. We're gonna mix it with the tips. I left a little water in there, and then oh, the puree on top. The puree on top. So, not waste any of it. No, no, don't do that. Here, hold this. There you go. You can lick it, but watch your tongue. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, not, Joe. Not recommended. Yeah, there, I wouldn't think. I wouldn't know why I wouldn't want to go right into that. <laughs> yeah, just stick right in there. And <laughs> now see, there's something wrong. Yeah, there you go. You got it. Good catch. <laughs> and, and the reason I wanted to use the shape of the pasta that I did those little bells. Is because it's going to get the puree in there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah that yeah, would so. have gone viral, by the way. <laughs> yeah, <I know. laughs> it's not worth it, believe me. <laughs> so anyway, you mix it up really they nice. They interviewed me on CBS this morning, but I wouldn't be able to talk because yeah. I got my tongue out. Yeah, to hit it with a little bit of olive oil, just a bit. Yeah, yeah. And I had my wife grating cheese all from what about uh, 11:30 to now. See the nice pile of cheese That's I got. Very nice pile of cheese. And so hold, hold your hand out, Andy. I'll give you a dab. Thank you. See, there you go. Thank you. Oh. Hi. Oh. Yeah. How can anybody concentrate on what he's doing when he's got these guys doing all the side the, the side show? No, I don't want to lick your finger. Okay. Are you kidding me? That's weird. <laughs> I mean, I'm Italian, but if, if it was my mm. mom's finger or my wife's finger, I wouldn't do go. it. Joe, I'm glad we get to spend these Thursdays <laughs> together. <laughs> okay, so now I hit it with a little bit of freshly grated Parmesan cheese. Mm -hmm. Very good. And I can't wait for a bellful. You're dropping it all uh, over the place, yeah. by the way. <laughs> good luck tonight, Scott. <laughs> <laughs> yes, your floor has been asparagated. <laughs> yeah, Scott's going to be sliding okay. all over the place. And all this right. is what we end That's up with. That's it. With the cheese. 
with the asparagus but, tips. Wait, wait, with wait. The asparagus yeah, that beautiful? And more Charlie, cheese. Charlie, it's not too much cheese, don't worry. On a good. day like today, oh, with the awesome. weather the way it is. What a meal. We'll, we'll get a sample of it when we come right back. Get the recipe at well, WIFR.com. I put a bunch of mozzarella over the top of it. <laughs> we'll be right back. It? Oh, oh, man, Joe's taking a big spoon. You're onto something here. This is good stuff. I like it. Yeah. I like it. Well, anyway, so it's something relevant to spring. We've got lots of asparagus everywhere. It's a nice dish. <clears throat> it's really not high in fat. You can leave off the cheese. Uh, there's about, for a pound of pasta, about a third of a cup of olive oil. Yeah. Um, you know, asparagus is, is really good um, it, it, as far as it's got a lot of minerals and things. It helps you. Um, uh, your, you know, digest uh, your glucose and right. and fats and things like that. It also, you know, uh, what? Plus, it's darn tasty. Yeah, the, this is the whole thing is just very good. And the Egyptians used to eat it to uh, for fatigue. Oh, so it, it, so, no. it would it would uh, get them, uh, you know, get them fired up, jacked up a little. Yeah, bit. Yeah. Right. And of course, good. it always that's why they build a pyramid. And it makes your peace more. Yeah. <laughs> we didn't talk about that. Thank, thank you, Joe. Don't forget the Sphinx. See you tomorrow. <laughs>